Hi and welcome to our ethical hacking series. Today we're diving into the world of web-based reconnaissance with a powerful tool called ReconNG. I'll teach you how to do domain analysis, secure email tracing, and social media reconnaissance. So let's see it in action. If you're not familiar with this tool, don't worry, it's easy to learn and very powerful. ReconNG is a full-featured web reconnaissance framework written in Python. With its modular approach, it aids in the collection of data during the reconnaissance phase of a penetration test. Always obtain proper permissions before conducting any form of penetration testing. The information provided in this content is for educational and informational purposes only. Unauthorized hacking is illegal. Okay, so let's start by setting up ReconNG on your system. You'll need Python and a few other prerequisites. In many Linux distros, this tool comes pre-installed. Let me walk you through some useful scenarios with some of the best features of this tool. Scenario 1. Domain Reconnaissance In this scenario, you're an ethical hacker hired by a company to assess their online security. You decide to start with domain reconnaissance, gathering as much information as possible about the company's domain. You fire up ReconNG and use the use the following command to select the domain host module. You set the source to the company's domain using the set source command, running the module with run to gather information about the domain including IP addresses, subdomains, and host names. This information allows you to understand the structure of the company's domain, which is crucial for identifying potential vulnerabilities. Scenario 2. Email Address Reconnaissance In this scenario, you're a cybersecurity consultant hired to investigate a data breach. The client suspects that an insider might be involved and they've provided you with an email address that they believe is suspicious. You decide to use ReconNG to gather more information about this email address. You start this tool and use the following command to select the PGP key search module. You set the source to the suspicious email address using the set source command. When you run the module with run, this tool starts to search for any public PGP keys associated with the email address. PGP keys are often used for secure communication, and finding a public key could provide clues about the email address owner's identity and activities. This information could be crucial in your investigation, helping you determine whether the email address is indeed linked to the data breach, and if so, how. Scenario 3. Social Media Reconnaissance In this scenario, you're investigating a phishing attack that's targeting your organization, the attackers are using social media to trick employees into revealing their login credentials. You turn to ReconNG and it's used the following command to select the Profiles module. You set the source to the suspected social media platform using the set source command. You then set the keyword to the suspected username or other identifying information. Running the module with Run, this tool starts to gather information about the suspected profile including tweets, followers, and other public information. This information can help you understand the attacker's methods and potentially identify who's behind the attack. Remember, these scenarios are for illustrative purposes and should only be carried out with proper permissions.